What is the pelvic floor? The pelvic floor comprises muscles and connective tissues. These soft tissues attach to your pelvis, and more specifically, to the bones at the bottom of the pelvis. In all people, the pelvic organs include the urethra, bladder, intestines, and rectum. If you have a vagina, the pelvic floor also consists of the uterus, cervix, and vagina. Three, a good way to visualize the pelvic floor and its function, says Marcy Crouch, a board-certified clinical specialist in women's health, is to picture these muscles at the bottom of the pelvis like a hammock or basket. When the pelvic floor is engaged or contracted, it performs a lifting motion toward your head, which feels like you are trying to stop gas or urine or pucker your anal opening, she says. In this video, we are going to talk about top five best pelvic floor muscle exercises. Five, bird dog. The bird dog also benefits many muscles, not just the pelvic floor. Find a space then start on all fours, with your hands directly below your shoulders and knees straight under your hips, keeping your back and neck completely straight. Move your right arm and left leg out, straightening them completely. Hold this position for about two seconds, then drop your arm and leg. Do this again with your left arm and right leg. Hold for two seconds and release. Continue to alternate like this 10 times and try to do three sets a day. Four split tabletop. This exercise might sound a little brutal, but it's actually quite easy and a well-known pelates move which also happens to strengthen the pelvic floor. Just as with the bridge, lie down so your back is completely flat on the floor, and lift your legs so they are bent at a 90-degree angle, with your feet pointing straight up. Slowly move your legs outwards, as far as it's comfortable. Keeping a slow pace, move your knees back together again. Make sure you are tightening your pelvic floor muscles while doing this. Repeat this 10-15 times and try to do 3 cycles a day. Three bridge. This exercise involves lying on the floor. So make sure before you start that you've got somewhere comfortable, preferably with carpet. Keep your back completely flat against the ground and make sure your feet are flat on the floor. Lift your knees so they are bent at a 90 degree angle. Take a good deep breath. Then tighten your pelvic floor while also lifting your bum off the floor. Your back should be straight and your body weight should be focused on your shoulders and upper back. Hold this position for about 3 seconds, then release. Repeat this 10 times. Rest for about a minute, then do another 10. Try and do this 3 times a day if you can. Two squats. This is a great exercise as it not only strengthens your pelvic floor muscles but also tones your bottom. It's important you get your stance correct though. Stand so your feet are only slightly further apart than your shoulders and have your toes pointing slightly outwards, keeping your back straight. Bend your knees while also pushing your hips and bum backwards. Make sure you only go as low down as is comfortable. Try to do 10 squats a day and feel those muscles getting stronger and stronger. One, kegels. Probably the most well-known exercise for those with incontinence, kegels are also amongst the best. They are really easy to do, and you don't even have to leave the comfy chair to do them. To get going with the kegels, simply imagine you are peeing, then locate the muscles you would use to stem the flow. Tighten these muscles and hold for between 5-8 seconds, and release for 10 seconds. Try not to clench any other muscles as you do this. Repeat this 10 times, 3 times a day. Keep going and you're sure to feel some benefits.
Thank you guys for watching. If you want more videos like this one, make sure to like the video and subscribe to our channel to never miss out any of our videos.